Jamie Fan asks how to compare a ranged tank like Blaze to a regular melee tank like Moran ETC. We will see, Jamie Fan. Let's get more info first. I really like those sausage pastries you can buy in Albert Heijn. I wish I could buy them in my country. Do you mean sausage brooches? <laughs> yeah, it's a nice quick snack. Greetings, friend. My girlfriend just broke up with me for stealing her wheelchair. But I'm not too worried about it. <laughs> she will come crawling back any day now. Ah. Uh. <laughs> That's probably a true story. A game was found. We're a five man against a three and a two man with a double tank, double range and a support. So it's a very balanced comp all the way around on both sides. D Dasit 94 says, how do you feel about the level 13 talents that leave oil behind you for E? Good escape? Yeah, I think so too. And to engage for that matter, because you get oil which you can then light a fire. A grote friet speciaal, alstublieft. <laughs> you know, uh, on the topic of political correctness, in snack bars, which is like where you can get french fries, meat snacks, uh, sausage, etc., goulash, whatever, this is a very common food place in the Netherlands. It's generally unhealthy, but extremely tasty snacks, generally deep fried. Anyway, in a, one of those snack bars, in all of them, uh, you can always order a special uh, French fries order, which is called uh, Patatje Orlog, which means French fries war style, or like I war think. French fries. Remember that first. And uh, on the topic of political correctness, they had temporarily deleted that menu option because it was, you know, insensitive. War fries, what? So I, what did they call it? Like party fries for a while but I, I don't know if it's allowed again Bad i'm not heroes. sure i thank you remember that first hell immortal spawns top now so you should form man top lane if you're hell side unless you want a defense of course but that's a good point i'm going to entirely ignore it though because uh, i'm not trying too hard yet just testing my stuff so there we go. Endurance stim back. Gonna go with the shield. <laughs> Bringing democracy fries. Yeah, I'm sure they're not nearly as tasty as war fries though, huh? How does war uh, war fries was just like onions and two kinds of sauce. That's it. Not very warlike for that matter, huh? First blood. T 
material. Have my angelic babies. What an announcer. Mercs, we always need mercs. If it was true war fr fries, there'd be no sauce. Yeah, that's true. Outstanding. You have been slain. I have tried that. Just curious how four fries compare in taste with in out burger animal style fries if you've tried them, P. One general thing that I think is probably true for the most part when you compare snacks in, in, in US snack bars and in ours, the US ones are going to taste better but are significantly heavier extra cheese and sauce I shall purge your evil from this land demon uh, I will get oil dispersal 10% extra slow in a bigger area that also means I'll be trying to set it on fire a little bit less more CC Until they leave the area and you use it for healing. Justice delivered. I think In and Out is one of my favorite snack bars in the United States of America. Well done. I like their burgers. Keep the healing flowing. Stop dropping down. Thank you very much for the dono of Rick Rick Rar. What is a snack bar? It's a not bar with snacks. A fine kill. Smoking. Well done. Uh. <laughs> Enemy. <laughs> baby. Enough of you. Enough of you. Crossfire. It's the only talent when you have the specs that I have so far. I march for Hell's Gates. <laughs> Outstanding. Yeah, if you go for oil dispersal, you would neither want grill and kill nor incinerator gauntlets. This is, in my opinion, the only downside to blaze design and i'm still figuring out if it's a necessary design choice for making it more complicated and having to make meaningful choices I must rest, heroes, or if it's just plain return. irritating because adhesive petroleum is such a big change in play style and i'm not sure yet what the answer is but for now I'm gonna be picking a lot of crossfire if I don't take adhesive petroleum. You can grow and kill, just have to manage light on fire later. But it means the total time in oil zone can last us 8 seconds. Good point, Pan7. You're a smart cookie. What a smart cookie. Let's engage for no reason at all. Well done. Double kill. Keep it up, 
Right, kind of like this, right? Leave an oil spill for four seconds and then finally light it on fire. Fire. We immortals shall return before long. Like that. Makes sense. My bunker's back. Justice delivered. Double kill. But KTZ got three stacks from the bunker. Right, post bunker. But not everyone had to stay till the end. Mayhem. The five extra bunker HP secured the kill. Probably. Blatantly broken. It's only Lunara on the top bunker. I shouldn't have lit it on fire. But luckily Zero Tool is up to the task. Progenitus. What a fancy name. Well done. What do I do? What do I do? I seek better ground. Justice delivered. That's stim pack. Decent poke damage. Enemy slain. Like Nano bunker. <laughs> I don't think you can. Untouchable. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Mega <laughs> kill. Mega lol. <laughs> Hey, Bunker Morris is back. I'll get the uh, fuel leak. Let's do this. That's the, good stuff. the light of the crystal arch shines on. Double whammy. Well, 
Careful, there's a bunker. A new hope dawns. MVP. Kayon says, Hey Grubby, could you play some Keltizard and teach how to use E with Glacial Spike? I'm just hitting my head in the wall. Ouch because I can't quite figure the range of their abilities. It's driving me nuts. Yar! <laughs> Nearly got uh, Medivh. Nice! 